Oh, hi. We have players, too, and everything. Uh, Cheryl Jones is here from a little place called Coronado, California. Welcome, Cheryl. Thank you. Obviously, just down the road a piece. You are an air traffic controller, it says. I'm an uh, air traffic controller with the FAA. Yeah. My husband, Haas, and I just got married two months ago. We oh. live on uh, San Diego's Crown Jewel Island of Coronado. Yeah, it's a beautiful place. Yes. You said Haas, right? Yes. Oh, his real name is Shumpert from Ruston, Louisiana. <laughs> <laughs> so his name is Shumpert, but he went with Haas. Haas is nickname, yeah. Oh, I got you. All right. Well, yeah. you have these decisions in life to make. Uh, what do you like doing when you're not uh, working with airplanes and bringing them in safely? I like to play golf, but my game is more like lawn bowling than golf, but I do enjoy it. All right, it's nice to have you, Cheryl. Good Very luck nice to you. To be here. This is Carrie Craig. It says here. Is this true, Carrie? It sure is. Uh, she's from Reno, Nevada. We'd like to hear all about you. Leave, leave, uh, don't leave out any detail, even the sorted ones. Go ahead, Carrie. Well, I work for an airline in the PR department, and I also am a beauty consultant for a major skincare yeah. and cosmetics firm. Are uh, you married? Yes, I am. Hi. Oh. What are you yes, doing? I'm Scott. <laughs> My great husband. Well, that's okay. That's all right. He's probably kissing the screen, even as we speak. Uh, you are a, a serious weightlifter, it says here. What can you lift? Uh... A lot. <laughs> oh, good. Like Scott, maybe? Or... Yes, I can. Well, that's more than we might want to know. It's nice to have you here, Carrie. Good Thanks. luck to you. And our third member of our little group is Chris Kelly, who came all the way from Greensboro, North Carolina, to be with us in the radio... I won't take it that personally. Right. <laughs> In the radio biz, what do you do? I'm a morning show disc jockey, a sidekick on a morning radio talk show, and so I have to get up very early. And uh, after I get off work, I like to play golf, tennis, baseball, basketball. So is it sport. one of those wacky, irreverent shows? It is a very wacky, irreverent show. You're going to yes. go back and just make hopeless fun of us? Uh, oh, yes. Yeah. Well, probably. <laughs> Depends yeah. whether you win or lose. Uh, right? She would probably lift me and beat me up if I did, but <laughs> <laughs> I certainly would like to. <laughs> But no, I won't. I'm sorry. No, I won't. <laughs> now you're in this on your own, Chris. <laughs> don't, don't look to me, pal. I've really gotten off to a good start. You're, the one, <laughs> you're the one in radio, Mr. Glib. Get out of this one. <laughs> Thank you. Nice to have you here, Chris. Thank Lots you. of luck to you. Thanks a lot. All right, let's get on with it. And there's our jackpot space. And here's our jackpot puzzle. The category is showbiz. Uh, Chris, who's been an observer in the game of life, will get a chance to spin the wheel now. Come on. All right. Four fifty. R. We have an R for you, and you have some money. There you go. Ah, rats. Well, I'm sorry, Cheryl. Seven hundred. A T. Mm -hmm, one T. I like can buy an E. You can do that too. There are two E's. Still at 450. Jackpot's over 6,000 already. Four hundred. An N, please. There are two N's. Uh huh. I'd like to buy an I. And there's an I. Yep. I'd like to buy an A. And we have some A's up there too. Five of them to be exact. Well, you're filling in a lot of spaces, Cheryl. You have just $750, but it's still your turn. Oh, man, after all that work. Oh. Carrie, your turn. Four fifty. S. Yes, one S. Oh, good. $7,000 jackpot now. Seven hundred. P. No, no P. Chris, it gets back to you oh, after all. Six hundred. M. Mm-hmm. Three M's. Now, Chris, my man, you have two thousand two hundred fifty dollars. The jackpot's eight thousand three hundred dollars. You want to take that into consideration? I think I'll spin. All right. Okay. Oh, brother. Now, let's call a letter here. L. There is one L. If you can solve the puzzle right now, you win that jackpot. Chris? Annual Daytime Emmy Award. You got it. <laughs> Oh, 
I was a little worried, Pat. I really was. Well, it's all right. It's funny. I'm just getting worried. Uh, you got $10,550. That's terrific because you won that jackpot, which uh, stood at 8300 You had some cash of your own. You're on the board in a big way. Congratulations. That was exciting. Well, let's uh, have some more excitement. We will come back, and we'll let Cheryl start our next round. We'll generate some more. Right back with more Wheel of Fortune from San Diego. Don't go away. Back for round four. There's a five thousand dollars space on the wheel. Category is occupation. Come on, Cheryl. All right, come on, big money. Two fifty. I have a T, please. Yes, two T's. All right. I'd like to buy a vowel. Mm -hmm. I'd like to buy an I. Yes, one I. Right. Whoops, hang on. That sound means time is running out. I'll give the wheel a final spin. Well, I'll ask you to give me a letter. Mr. Puzzle, you'll have five seconds to solve it. Vowels worth nothing, consonants worth 250. Best we can do. Occupation, the category. And Cheryl, still you turn a letter, please. An N? No, no N. Okay. Carrie. R. Two R's. And when they come up, you'll have five seconds. Chris. F. One S. Yada dee. Okay. Cheryl. An L. Two L's. You're up to $750. Occupation. Carrie. P. Nope. Chris. B. There is a B. Book illustrator? Yeah, that's it, uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Do it again. Well, even though, uh, even though you finished in second place, uh, boy, you have nothing to be ashamed of at all. That $500 takes you to $11,050. All packed. Harry Punchers, thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank okay. you. Okay.